Welcome to howtocookthat.net. For a printable copy of the recipe, go to www.howtocookthat.net or click on the link below the video. Today we're looking at how to make custard sphericals. First thing you're going to need to do is prepare an alginate bath using distilled water. The water needs to be distilled or the calcium ions in tap water will react with the alginate causing it to gel. Blend for at least three minutes, pour it into a bowl and put it in the fridge for a couple of hours. You need to allow the alginate time to rehydrate and you also need to allow all those air bubbles to come out. Then take spoonfuls of your prepared custard mixture. The recipe for the custard is on the website, just click on the link below and pop spoonfuls into the alginate mixture. Leave it for a couple of minutes. If you're adding more than one spoon at a time make sure they're not touching each other or the gel will form around the two of them together. Stir them every now and then to make sure that the gel is forming evenly around the whole sphere so that you don't have any holes or weak points. Then using a spoon lift it up, drain off any excess and pop it into a bowl of water. Stir it round, this just washes off the extra alginate gel and stops the membrane from getting any thicker. You can store it in the bowl of water until you're ready to serve. I like to put the custard ones in a bowl of hot water to heat them up so it heats up the custard inside and then place it on your plated dessert. For more molecular gastronomy recipes go to www.howtocookthat.net or click on the link below the video.